I know where my elephant went, it went here, where we are. I don't know where the leopards went, however, and so I'm just going to give up on them and pretend that I didn't really want to find them in the first place. Now, this elephant bull has emerged from the bushes in order to have a conversation with us. Conversation, I hear you say? Uh, conversation, yes, I have to repeat to you, because he came along, there was no reason for him to come here, other than for us. We stopped here and he came wandering through and started eating that signal grass that he's eating there. It's called Eurocloa mozambicensis. It's uh, supposed to be quite a nice, I was just reading this actually, it's, it's very palatable, relatively good nutritional value and it's one of those rare grasses that increases with pressure and so it's quite a nice grass to have in your area, except that it does indicate that there is disturbed um, soil. Why am I telling you that? Well, just because I'm pretty much sure that I've told you absolutely everything I know about elephants over the last little while, and I haven't told you about the grasses that he's eating. And he's being very selective. He's only selecting for that one species the signal grass and while he is eating, he's eating quite a lot of the structural stuff he's also pulling them out at the roots and at the leaves at the bottom of the plant and that's very important because that's where the good stuff is I suppose you'll get a little bit out of the seeds but you know to get anything out of those seeds you've really got to macerate them and elephants don't do a great deal of chewing just about all other grazers will come and avoid eating the culms or the stalks and they'll only go for the leaves and he's eating the whole bunch and while he's been sitting here I'm just going to talk a little bit more quietly in the hopes that he comes a bit closer while we've been sitting here he's probably eaten oh, I don't know almost a hay bale's worth probably and I say he's having a conversation with us. You can see he's moving closer to us. There's no reason for him to doing this. be doing this. There's this signal grass all over the place. I'm convinced that young elephants get bored. And I think they like having a conversation with us. They like having a little bit of an interaction. Just entertains them slightly in the long day of having to eat almost completely continuously. He's now sitting probably about two and a half meters from us. That's about, say, 10 feet or so. A bit more than that. This is wonderful. So the little leopard cubs, I don't know where they are. We've checked where they were before. They're not there anymore. We will do our best to sort of keep around this area. And I think Tristan's gonna come down and have a look for them as well.